John McTague. I'm a political science professor at Towson University. And um, I'm out here because I'm teaching a class on inequality, and my students are required to come out here and do community service as nice. part of the class instead of writing a research paper. Nice. So, uh, what have your students learned from the class so far? Um, I think the well, they've learned. I think they've learned a lot. I hope they've learned a lot. <laughs> I'm sure they have. Um, I think one of the things that's been eye-opening for them about coming out here and doing um, the service work with the six branch has been. Um, it's opened their eyes to uh, opportunities they've had that a lot of other people mm -hmm. maybe haven't had. Um, uh, they, after they come out and do some work for the sixth branch, they have to write a, a paper about it. And the questions I'm asking them in this paper are, you know, so describe the physical conditions of the, uh -huh. the neighborhood that you were in, and how did those conditions differ from the neighborhood where you grew up? And uh -huh. um, I think it gives them some sort of you know, you can read about something in a book. Uh -huh. You could watch, like they, they watch The Wire, and the, <laughs> so you can watch about, the, you know, something on TV. But to actually see something with your eyes, um, and, and actually physically be out there doing something in a place like the work that's being done in this park. Absolutely. Uh, there's more of a visceral connection. Absolutely. To, to those issues than if you're just reading about it or watching. It. Absolutely. Yeah. So how about your shop? What have you learned uh, so far from this project and from teaching this class? Um, I have learned that I'm out of shape. <laughs> <laughs> swinging a sledgehammer around last week and uh, felt that for a few days. Um, I've learned, I've learned a lot of the lessons that I want them to learn. You know, uh, Great. The same way that I've, I'm, you know, book smart about this stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I know the scholarly research about this stuff. Mm -hmm. um, it, it really the, that same connection is, is it's it's a deeper connection to the issues and a deeper connection to um, the causes of inequality and the, mm -hmm. the consequences of inequality to come out here and see it every mm -hmm. Friday. Absolutely. Um, so uh, you know, and that's that, that that's part of the, the one of the joys of teaching. I think is that you learn from teaching. There's no better way to learn something than to teach it. Absolutely. And so the the homework that I give them, I end up having to do myself, and, and I'm. I'm hoping they're they're getting like half as much out of it as I am <laughs> because you know I'm really into this stuff. Absolutely. Um, so uh, it's been a it's been a really great experience. I hope to repeat it um, in uh, semesters to come. Uh, it's been it's been something that <clears throat> I hope I can mimic in other classes. You know, um, if not something quite like this, getting students out of the classroom though that whole idea of mm -hmm. sort of experiential learning, doing mm -hmm. by, learning by doing. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I'd known about it, and this is the first time I've done it. It's been just Yeah, awesome. Well, uh, thank you for being so passionate about what you're teaching. I'm sure your students definitely pick up on that. I'm sure they appreciate that, that as well. Yeah, hope so. Yeah. Uh, we'll see. We'll see how they do uh, on their final papers. <laughs> cool, cool. All right, let's get back to work. All right, cool. All right.